Hello everyone, in this video I will explain to you how you can track moving objects inside DaVinci Resolve. The first video is not edited and the second one is having the tracking method that you are about to learn how you can make it. In order to add it, you need to highlight your media. You can then go to your fusion page right here. Then you will see media in and out. You want to highlight media in, then press control space. And then in the search bar, you can type planner tracker. You can highlight it and click on add. Then it will be connected between your media in and out. You want to highlight it. You want to go to the section of the video on which you want to start your tracking. I'm going to pick my very first frame. Then I'm going in the inspector and selecting set. It is located next to reference time. Next on tracker, you can select hybrid point. And below that on motion type, you can select translation. Once we got that out of the way, we can start selecting the area on which we want to track. You can hold on control on your keyboard so you can zoom in using your scroll. And then you can go over the area on which you want to track. In my case, I'm going to use this face. So just briefly, I'm going around their face and I'm connecting the first and last dot. The next step is that you can go back to your inspector on the right side. And then you can select this button, which is saying track forward. And by pressing it, the software will start tracking the area that you have just selected until the end of the video. You're going to notice that there are some tiny lines on the timeline. These are actually the keyframes that are tracking the masking. When we got this out of the way, you can go to operation modes and you can go to the drop down menu and select stabilize. Another thing that you will notice after selecting the stabilize on the operation mode is that when the video is playing through, even that is tracking the subject on the area that you have just masked, there are some parts of the video that are going out of frame. In order to fix these borders, we want to highlight the video, go to inspector and zoom in and change the position XY values, making sure everything is still in frames. I'm just playing it through right now. As I can see, it is tracking her face and also it's not going out of frame. Simple as that. You can also watch this video right here. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.